Dear Santa, please don't bring me any more underwear or socks. I really want some cool guy gear. I've been really good this year, kind of. The Prepared Wanderer. Yeah, cool guy gear. That's what I want. What is going on Wanderers? Prepared Wander in the Man Cave and today we are going to be talking about a gift guide of cool EDC gear for dudes. Well, okay, all this stuff is not exclusively for dudes. So if the ladies, if you like this stuff, that's cool too. But I thought I would put together a gift guide of some of the coolest stuff that I've just got from some really great companies. I think these are awesome um, EDC items um, that are just, you're gonna, you're gonna see this stuff and go, wow, this is really good stuff, this is cool. Um, this has my stamp of approval. Um, I'm really blown away by these products and I wanted to show them to you, share them with you because of course we are in the middle of the gift giving season. Everybody is out shopping, getting stuff for their loved ones and friends and Sometimes even people they don't like, but um, if you got someone you love, this is some great stuff. So we're going to jump right into it, show you these items, and then you can tell me what you think about them. Um, so what I have here is a collection of really awesome gifts that any guy or gal would appreciate. These are kind of EDC um, uh focused but not necessarily um, EDC of course I'm always fascinated in looking for cool EDC gear um, of course EDC everyday carry but this stuff goes beyond that um, there are certainly some items in here that will help with your bushcrafting and maybe your survival gear so let's jump right into it and look at some of this stuff the first thing we have here is this set that I got from Holtzman's Gorilla Survival. Now, if you're not familiar with this company, um, they have a bunch of, of knives um, online and on Amazon. And uh, I recently picked up one of their knives. And what I got is I got this little guy, this cool little EDC carry neck knife. And of course, the first thing you notice when you get it is, is the awesome gift box that they put it in, and then how everything that you need for this knife comes with it. So, of course, we got this great little blade. It's D2 steel. Really a fantastic little knife, put together very well. Um, sharp right out of the box. Just a great little design. Not much more you can say about that, right? Just it's it's a cool knife. But what's really awesome about this set is that it comes with all these other things. So of course we have a nice quality Kydex sheath. Good positive retention. Comes with a chain so you can wear it around your neck, or it comes with a cord. So if you prefer a neck cord, you can wear it that way. Um, what's kind of cool about this sheet is it actually has uh, like a little uh, strip of like the diamond um, material for sharpening. So if you want to sharpen your knife quickly in the field or when you're out and about, you can do that. And then you'll notice here we've got a little holder and that is for a mini ferro rod. How cool is that, right? So now you got your ferro rod, your knife, they both match. They've got the orange, I, bought, I picked the orange, so you got the orange liners 
really just a nice looking set. This is just a great little neck knife. Of course, EDC, camping, bushcrafting, whatever, a great choice. And then um, on top of that, they also include a belt clip, in, if you'd rather do it that way, and all the hardware for the clip is included, um, and even a wrench for installing that stuff. So it, it's just a, it, it's a great um, gift set, nice box. You don't have to put it in a different box. You can just wrap this up. And they have so many different types of knives. Um, I'm hoping I get more this year and try them out. They just came out with some really cool uh, pocket knives that I'm really intrigued by. They look awesome. Just really a cool company. Uh, all different sizes of knives, so check them out. They'll be in the Amazon store and a link down below if you're interested in this knife. So another product that I wanted to share with you guys today is the new <clears throat> Gerber Dual Force. And if you are into EDC uh, gear, of course, multi-tools are an awesome item to have with you. Um, basically a toolbox in your pocket. First of all, the size of this thing is impressive. It is a, it is a big tool and there's a reason for that. Because you are getting, instead of a standard needle nose lineman style pliers, you're getting a slip style, uh, channel lock style um, set of pliers. And that's really what sets this tool apart from all the others. And um, I think it's also one reason why they made it a little bit bigger because it really is much more than just a, a pocket tool that kind of does certain jobs okay. Uh, this thing really does a great job with nuts and bolts. Um, and since you can adjust it, uh, you can even get in there with bigger stuff or adjust it down. And with the tip, that they put on this, you can actually get down and pull small stuff like staples and small nails and things like that, tacks. So very versatile tool. Uh, the only difference is uh, compared to most uh, normal multi-tools, the wire cutters or strippers are not down or not here. They're in the back down in here. And that makes it a little, um, a little different uh, in using it, but it is doable. And then, of course, uh, since this is such a bigger handle than most of the other multi-tools, you have bigger tools all the way around. And the other thing that I love about this particular one is the center drive screwdriver or bit holder. Um, as you know, most you know Leatherman style tools the bit holders are very small and they're short. Well, this thing actually has some length to it so you can reach um, and get a little bit of leverage on what you're working on. And it fits normal bits, uh, nothing oddball. If you wanna change out some bits, there are actually some extra ones included and they are stored here, which is kind of a unique system. So that flips open and you've got a smaller Phillips and that flips down and then on this side you flip that one up and you've got your standard bit so it comes with two additional bits as well as the one that's in the center drive and then of course this tool locks um, you just press the frame down and that releases it now the other tools that come on this are a very nice um, file and what's kind of unique about the file is that on the end of it there actually is a chisel um, it's sharpened um, it's a little unique a little odd um, you know I think um, a lot of people probably would have preferred a pry bar on the, on this but the chisel you know it, it may have some applications and then of course this locks as well on this side, we've got a knife and 
not serrated, which is great. A lot of the, the multi-tools usually put a serrated blade on these. And of course you can tell pretty decent size for, for a knife blade. And then on this side, there is a very nice heavy duty saw. It's actually got some thickness to it, um, very aggressive teeth. Um, and that's it for the tools. I mean, there is no extra fluff. You don't have can openers, bottle openers, scissors, all those kind of extra things that a lot of times you really don't utilize. This, in my opinion, is really geared towards um, the homeowner, the handyman. Um, it's a, it would be a great multi-tool to throw into your truck because if you don't want to have to dig out your tool set, you could you know, easily loosen or tighten a, a bolt or a nut with it. And then the case that comes with it, nylon, you can wear it vertically or horizontally. And it does have a pocket. Next two items are from a company that I'm sure we're all familiar with, Olite. Um, this is O Knife, and O Knife um, is a company that uh, goes along with O Light. I think it's a subsidiary. Um, and I just got these, and I was kind of blown away. Um, you know, I like to think of myself as a pretty knowledgeable knife guy. I can definitely spot um, junk, and I can spot quality. And the first item that I got from O Knife was the Fortitude fixed blade. And when I opened this sucker up, I was, whoa, this is cool. I like this. So first thing you get is you get a cool patch, Velcro patch, PVC. It's kind of neat. A quality Kydex sheath with a tech lock style uh, clip on the back. So you can put that on your belt. Love these kind of um, locks. These are great. They really stay in place on your belt and it makes it easy to put it on and off a belt without taking your belt off. So um, great option there. And then of course the knife itself. There it is, the Fortitude. Um, I love this thing and I cannot wait to get this out in the field and play with it because I think this is going to be a great all-purpose survival bushcraft knife. Um, <clears throat> I love the design of the blade uh, because with this style blade, in my opinion, um, it's very versatile because you can do, of course, camp chores. Uh, wood processing, but you can also clean clean game and fish with it. Uh, it's not an overly heavy knife, but it is a very solid knife. And then it's got G10 handles that have some nice contouring in it. So you got a good grip. It fits my hand perfectly. D2 steel again. Love D2 steel. You've got a lanyard hole there. It is full tang, decent thickness, right? Little bit of a thumb ramp right there, sharpening choil, a groove and a guard on the bottom. Perfect little knife. This thing is awesome. And it's not hugely expensive if I remember correctly. Now O Knife um, has a coupon code for you guys. <clears throat> that will be down in the description below that will have the amount that you get off if you order through their site and if you put in that coupon code especially for you guys you can get this a little bit cheaper so uh, <clears throat> like I said I uh, I just cannot wait to play with this knife plus it is just darn cool looking I mean look at that OD green blade black and OD green handles OD green my favorite color in the whole wide world that is the O-Knife Fortitude. Fantastic. <clears throat> Another cool O-Knife product that I just got is this guy. Let's see if I can get this open for you. This is their multifunctional pry bar. It is titanium and it is called the Octal 2 Mini. Um, pretty neat. Look at that. 
neat design. It has a pocket clip on it, which is really cool. Something you can slip into your pocket um, or put in your bag. Love the design of it. Just it's just the it's a really cool looking product. But the neat thing new. about this is the lanyard hole actually I believe is a four millimeter hex. So um, it does come with some paracord in case you want to do a lanyard on it. Um, I think I'm just going to leave mine without the lanyard so I can utilize that hex in case I need it. Um, but just a super neat little product. Um, of course, you can get that on O Knife site as well with the discount code and get some money off of that. So really great little stocking stuffer right there for the guys and the gals. Another awesome EDC product that I've found um, is from a company called Axwell. And this is um, a minimalist wallet. Um, you know, if you guys think back to the day like when your dad used to carry a wallet, and those things, I remember my dad's wallet was huge. The thing was thick. I mean, I, I can't believe that as guys, we walked around with these gigantic wallets all the time. They were huge. They were uncomfortable. You know, we had a, a million cards in them, <clears throat> ton of cash, and it, they just, it was not a great way of carrying stuff. Well, minimalist wallets have become very popular. There's a lot of different brands out there. Axwell has come onto the market, and I think they have a really cool design. Uh, this is a metal wallet that has a money clip in the back. But what is kind of different about this particular one is one thing that they've done is they've put a, a cutout on the bottom, and what you do is you're able to push the cards out and fan them out and get what, what you need that way. And I'll show you what, what I have in here. Um, but also, what's really cool is the plates or the covers are magnetic. And if you want to switch this out and you don't want, let's say, the money clip, take that off. There you go. So you've got a money band or you can do a money clip. It's up to you how you want to utilize it. And then the nice thing about um, Axwell is that the, since the covers are magnetic, you can order different covers, different colors, different graphic patterns. Um, so you can customize your wallet, make it look different. They also sell some accessories. So there's an accessory card. Uh, this one has uh, different wrenches built into it. There's a, a comb. Um, they also have like a more like a, a traditional survival card that you can get. And then they also have this little um, piece that you can order. This is a, a coin tray. What you do with this is you open it up And you slip that inside, okay? And now that becomes part of the wallet. And then when you need a coin, you just fan that out, grab what you want, close that back up. You can also keep a spare key in there. So it's it's really up to you how you customize this. You can make it, you know, do whatever you want with it. Last but not least is this very awesome new bag that I just got from Nutsack. So lots of videos on YouTube about Nutsack. They are a maker of some really nice premium uh, canvas leather uh, satchels and EDC gear. Uh, this is the Tack Sack 13. Um, <sighs> it is so awesome. I have been carrying this for a while, a couple weeks now, and um, I have really enjoyed the features on this thing. Um, it's just such a cool uh, satchel for everyday carry. So this is the black model. They also come in kind of a, a brownish um, color. Um, I really like the black. It's just really, it's sharp looking. Um, it has, on the flap, it has magnetic closures on the corners. 
and those magnets are, are, are pretty good. Um, I have not had this thing come open on me. It also has a leather uh, strap that you can secure the bag this way uh, with the closure, the button closure. Now, still kind of new. Um, I don't really utilize that. I keep it open and I use the magnets because the magnets do a really good job of holding the flap down. Um, this is nice if you're traveling and you want to keep someone out of your bag, you can do that. Um, but for just, you know, back and forth to the office, I leave it open. That way I can get into my stuff quickly. Um, the back of it, it has a really nice grab handle. Um, we've got canvas webbing with reinforced leather. What I love about it is that that grab handle always stands up. <clears throat> so when I need to grab my bag and hit the road, I can do that. Um, it's always there. Of course, you've got a nice uh, webbing strap with padding. Not overly done, um, which is good, um, but uh, enough to make it very comfortable. It's very adjustable, so you can carry this crossbody over the shoulder. Um, what I love about this also is you got metal hardware with swivels on the strap, but you can remove the strap. So if you're traveling and for whatever reason you want to take that strap off um, because it's getting in the way, you can do that. And now you just have the bag, so maybe it packs a little bit easier inside a larger bag. Um, and then the back has a slip pocket, which you know runs the full length and depth of the bag. So for those quick items, but also, I don't know if you can tell, but in here, there is some webbing sewn in with some loops. So you could put, of course, some kind of Molly uh, pouch or whatever on this, but what I'm utilizing it for is, it's a great place to slip in items that you want to grab quickly. So I've got uh, one of my little attitude adjustment tools with me that slips in there really nicely. Um, over here, I've got another great item from Gerber. This is their tactical pen. So it's a pen, but also it is metal and has a glass breaker tip. So I keep that handy over here on the side. Blends right in, no one knows it's there. On the sides of this bag um, is another very cool feature. You've got zippers that run up. You have dual zippers so you can go both ways, but you can get into the bag from the side. So, I think really the application for this is if you have something in here that you want to be able to grab quickly um, and easily, you don't have to open up the whole bag to get to it. So I know for some people this may be a concealed carry kind of option. I don't carry my guns typically off my body. They're usually on me at all times. Um, but it's an option. So you could have this in your vehicle. You could have a, um, a holstered weapon in here and then pull that out quickly. So you got access to the sides. And then when we open this up, of course, nice heavy duty zippers that open and close very easily, very smooth. They have little leather pull tabs on them, which is great. And then they go all the way down the sides but not open all the way and then what I really like about this bag um, more so than any EDC bag that I've had in the past um, is that it stands up even when it's empty on its own and it's because the material is stiff you have the wax canvas on the outside and then you have this nice heavy-duty lining on the inside these things are awesome. Made in USA, says right there on the label. You've got two big slip pockets. One there, one there. And then what makes this the TAC SAC 13 is that you have a Molly panel. I'll take this stuff out so you can see. 
There's a Molly panel that runs the entire back side of the bag. So this is going to give you a lot of customization options. You can add pouches. Uh, it's of course the Molly is a great place to, just to put pens and tools. You can organize them there. I think I might put my pry bar that I just got right there and carry that with me. I've got uh, my flashlight in here. So a lot of different options you can do with setting up gear. Now I'm running it kind of slick right now. Um, I've been trying to think what pouches I want to do because if I add pouches, it's of course going to eat into the space. Um, so that's a consideration. But um, I think there's certainly a couple maybe small pouches I could add in here uh, to help organize my gear. Now, why is it the 13? Well, uh, 13 because of the size. It fits 13 inch laptops perfectly. So we've got a little, um, a little MacBook here that fits in there very nicely. Um, I can carry my MacBook. I can also carry my Amazon Fire tablet that fits in there perfectly. Um, it's just a great size. They do make um, an 11, which I thought for my needs was a little too small, but then they also make a 15, which is bigger. So if you guys got the bigger laptops, you're good to go. But the 13, I think is the sweet spot. It is not an overly ba big bag. Um, it fits just the essentials. You're not carrying a ton of stuff. Um, and you don't need to, you don't need all that weight on your shoulder. And of course the bottom, leather nice premium leather heavy duty that helps it stand up as well and just makes it look great and like i say i think the black is so sharp um, but they do have the brown and they may even have a gray if i remember correctly but you'd have to check the site so check nuts uh, sacks uh website out they will have everything there with prices and stuff this is not a cheap bag so if you're expecting to go and get something you know uh super cheap this isn't it this is a premium quality edc bag made in the usa and it's worth every penny i think they're around 200 dollars um but check out their website for sure and i'll have links down below for that as well i hope this gift guide helped you guys out a little bit um you know this is i think some great quality gear for the dude and dudettes in your life um there's some excellent items with some good value and there's some really well-made stuff in here that is just you know fantastic okay as always thank you for watching my videos please check out preparedwanderer.com that is the new prepared wanderer website um, it has a bunch of information i've got guests writing cool blog, blog articles with lots of good information there's links to the videos there is the web store on there for ordering prepared wanderer gear you can get prepared wanderer patches and stickers so these make great stocking stuffers we've got the subdued prepared wanderer patch with a velcro back and then a really nice heavy duty 3m sticker uh, indoor outdoor this will you can put this on your truck your car and it will last so that helps support the channel um, thank you as always for watching and we will see you next time on the prepared wanderer merry christmas